Good morning. U.S. President Trump addressed to the nation vowed to calm investor concerns about the economic fallout from the coronavirus outbreak. Instead, Trump announced restrictions on travel from Europe into U.S., which further intensify market fear. Besides, although U- Euro Central Bank ECB offered more liquidity, it did not lower interest rates. U.S. stock markets plunge on Thursday. The Fed announced to inject 1.5 trillion U.S. dollar temporary liquidity into the markets and buy additional bonds. It once helped the U.S. stock markets to narrow its loss. However, selling pressure emerged afterwards. All three major U.S. stock indices closed 9 to 10 percent lower on Thursday. U.S. stock markets fell into bear market. For looking, ECB and Fed further injected market liquidity, but global stock markets continue panic selling. In fact, Euro and U.S. government failed to impose effective measures to deal with epidemic. It has hurt investor confidence. Besides, S&P 500 index fell to 15 times prospective PE, while UK and Germany stock markets fell to 11 times. The market is extremely oversold. Investors are now looking for Euro and U.S. governments to launch massive fiscal stimulus to restore economy growth. Given panic selling in global stock markets, Hong Kong will continue to suffer, continue to suffer selling pressure today. However, China epidemic has been under control. Together with monetary and fiscal stimulus, China stock prospect is relatively stable. Hansen Index current valuation is below 10 times prospective PE, which is extractive. Thank you.